Welcome to CO3 Beer Showdown. Today, we've got two more Talos beers. Yeah, that's right. Hydra versus Gemini. Let's see which one's best. Look at the color difference right there. <laughs> Definitely. That's crazy. <laughs> Let's start with, I think actually we want to start with Gemini because it's thinner. Yeah, so this one's definitely super thin. This one is like a puree. And we usually start left to right, but let's let's do this one because it is thinner. The Gemini is sour ale brewed with plum, pineapple, and crepe crumble. 7%. How do you crumble a crepe? I guess I you thought just, they were rolled. Yeah, they're kind of soft, right? So yeah. you have to like... So is this like an old crepe that somebody had left over? <laughs> I don't or Talis, think... did you just leave your crepes out and said, let's crumble these? I hope they did because it smells amazing. Oh my God. That's good. Damn, that's good. Plum, pineapple, crepe. I definitely get plum. Some plum flavor there. I'm not really getting the pineapple. Maybe mm -hmm. a little bit, actually, after taste. It might bit. just add some sweetness to it, maybe. Yeah, just that sugar. But the plum pops through. And is the, the crepe almost like... So I for smell some reason, pastry, like, yeah. but I don't taste it. I feel like there's almost like vanilla in here. For some reason, I'm getting like almost like a creamy... You know what they could mean? Not actually a crepe crumbled. Like a crepe crumble, like what the insert, like what they would put inside of a crepe. Oh. Could be like the, the vanilla like um, frosting slash yogurt kind of thing. I'm wondering if I'm that's... not as fancy as you. I've never had a crepe. So any of our viewers that are watching this, <laughs> I've been deprived of crepes, so please send me a crepe. But it tastes amazing. It's just like a way, creamy plum juice. There's a lot going on in there. Yeah. <laughs> Even though it's, it's pretty thin, but you can see just... You can see the... There's so much stuff sediment. floating around in there. Yeah. But it's so smooth. It's not like it's got chunks. It's no. just... It's just flavor crystals. Mmm. So I think this, though... That's a summer drink. And this is... As much as I love Mortalis, this is a taster. The more I drink it, it's so sweet. Mm, it is really sweet. I was I was just thinking that this this isn't complete without an umbrella. <laughs> like it I feel like we should be sitting on like lounge chairs in front of a beach, little umbrella and just sipping this away. It's not when it's two degrees outside. <laughs> I definitely agree that it's like super fruity super like beachy vibes because yeah. it's so fruity and i get like a pastry feel to it which is good but i can't i can't put my finger on what that is or why it tastes like that it's almost like the butteriness of yeah a pancake but definitely the plum is the shining star oh yeah which is good i actually like so I know Mortalis and a lot of the different breweries around here have been just adding more and more ingredients. And I think some of the ones that we've had lately, it's just too much. And we've, yeah. we've said that I just want sometimes one thing. And this is, this is exactly what we were talking yep. about. Yep. Pick a couple fruits. Plum is not the first fruit I would choose, but it's coming through pretty strong. It tastes good. I, I like it. Had, yeah. Plum's not something that you just have on hand all the time, but it's a good flavor. Yeah. All right, let's move on to Hydra. So this Hydra is... is a syrup. <laughs> oh, it is so thick. It, it's it's thick. So what do we got? This is the... Right over here. Mango, passion fruit. Passion fruit, peach. mango, peach. 7%. So the same percentage. Wow. I, <laughs> I, I jumped the gun. Passion fruit and mango. I smell big time. But when you taste it, what do you get? Whoa! That's like biting into a fruit. That is that is biting into a mango yeah. with some pear or a peach, fruit. peach juice. 
juice oh, after. Like that when, is... when you let it sit, you're getting some of that pe peach at the end. But it's like biting into a mango. It's you just the juiciest fruit you've ever had. You're biting into, that's what you're getting. This is nectar. <laughs> nectar. It's nectar. It really is. It's that it's thick. It's so thick. Mm. I think somebody actually I don't think this is beer. I think Mortalis is lying to us and they just took a bunch of mangoes. They blended them up really fine. <laughs> canned it. Canned it. You and don't it, think they dropped There's it. a tiny bit of bite to it, so I, I'm thinking they maybe like two drops of vodka. <laughs> you don't think they took a single hop and just tossed it in there? Maybe with the whole vat. <laughs> so <laughs> then they could call around. it beer. Because I... Do you taste hops? Do, no. Do you get a single hop? Which I'm not mad at. No. This it's... is... Again... This needs this needs like a mango slice and an umbrella. Yeah. Uh, another one though, I well, I probably could down this one can, but I'll edit us on the beach. Just sitting back. It's pretty much what we're at, we're doing right now with these beers. Wow. That is like again, I think in Mortalis does this amazing. These two are the perfect tasters. Mm-hmm. You get these in a flight. Oh my gosh. You are so happy. Like this is have your friends color, over grab taste. grab these and do like a little beach tiki theme. Yeah. Get a little coconut glasses and throw throw this stuff in there with an umbrella. That's gonna be fun. Don't bring the burly oak rum drink though. <laughs> do not do that. <laughs> no. But this is just I mean it's crazy. But you couldn't... This is so sugary. Yeah. And so thick. Like, to, for me to grab a mug right here... <laughs> That'd be tough. Uh, that's instant diabetes. Yeah. I just... I can feel... I know there's so much acid. Yeah. That I just know that this is not... You don't want to drink a lot of this. But... But you do want to drink a lot yes. of this. Yes. In terms of a taster, I mean, it's nectar. It's it's you're biting into the juiciest fruit you've ever held in your hands. Yeah, I've never, I don't think I've ever been into a fruit this this thick and juicy. Man, mm. this is tough. That's actually a tough one. Yeah, this is tough. You know, I gotta have a little bit more of this because I really want to know. I got my mind made up. Okay. They're both extremely flavorful, fruity, and just delightful to, to sit there and sip on. Yep. You're not going to pound it. There, there's no reason to waste it by sitting there drinking it fast. Tiny sip at a time, let it sit in your mouth. Enjoy that flavor. Uh, both of them. So, go ahead. You go, because you say you know. Oh, I... I'm still torn. <laughs> oh, you are. I cannot get by this mango. I love mango flavor. And this is a puree of mango. It's it's fruit juice. I think I see a chunk of mango in there. <laughs> it's so good though. Next video oh. we're gonna buy a mango. <laughs> we're gonna just drink this and eat the mango and see which one is more of a mango. <laughs> which one's more mango-y? <laughs> and I think this is going to this is like concentrated mango. I've never bitten into, I don't know how many times I can say the word mango right now, but <laughs> I've never bitten into a mango and gotten this condensed of a flavor. It's so good. Man, I wish I could argue. <laughs> I, I can't. This one's good, though. It's right? so good, and I, I had another sip of it to so make good. sure. It's so good, but this is straight mango. It's on another level. It, it's just... It's so good. You get these beers once in a while, like Mortalis. I love Mortalis, and we all know that. And like ninety-nine percent of their beers are amazing. But even with their standard being up here, there's ones like this that just once in a while they shoot that level through the roof, and this is one of them. I think it's just yeah. it needs to be a staple on their menu forever. And for me, it comes down to the same thing that I was talking about with the flight. You go to Mortalis, you get a flight, and you're always amazed. Yep. And this is one of those cogs 
the color, the smell, the taste. Mm -hmm. You have this... The viscosity. <laughs> in a flight. Mm -hmm. And you just... You go, this is why I come to Mortalis. Okay. Is to get unique, ridiculous, amazing things like this. And what did we both do when we sampled it? I couldn't even hold back. <laughs> I, I tried it, and I, I realized you hadn't had any, and I, I was going to try to just like not say anything, but I was like, oh god, this is, good. <laughs> this is yeah. so good. Yeah. So, I mean, it just comes down to Martels making great beers. Both of these were very good, very unique, very delicious. But Hydra, that mango really shined through. Those heads of the Hydra, man. And it, it won this round, for sure. All right, guys, that's all we got for you. Thanks so much for watching. We hope you enjoyed this one. If you did, make sure to like, subscribe, and we'll see you next time.